Watching some wealthy and famous families lately game the system to get their kids into college is a real reminder of how difficult it is for regular families who want to get their, frankly, more talented students into the school of their dreams. Our Byron Reed took his camera to see how Aurora Public Schools Foundation is trying to level the playing field. I thought it was only one year. Hana Fintanhoon has been doing plenty of thinking. Yeah, <laughs> it's really stressful. About her freshman year of college. Making sure all my requirements are finished before I get to GW. Hana just graduated from Rangeview High School and is going to George Washington University in the fall. She's a first generation college student and is trying to figure out just how she's going to pay for school. $75,000 a year. My parents initially came to the United States for me and my sister to get a better education. So it's really important for them to have, like, for us to have a successful future. You did the gear up for them? Yeah. Them? Okay. Part of that success was made possible by her school's college and career center. It's run by the Aurora Public Schools Foundation to help students with information about scholarships, college application requirements, and financial aid. The students of Aurora come from a really diverse demographic. So over 130 countries, over 160 languages. We've helped over 10,000 students since 2014. And we're, on average, we're seeing about 2,500 students come through our centers. The group says they want to create equal opportunities for all students in the Aurora a competitive college admission process. We do know that for every one dollar that we invest in a college and career center, we're unlocking a hundred dollars worth of potential scholarships for students. It helps the playing field in the sense of our students are exposed to opportunities where they can apply to more schools. So students like Hana can afford to go to the college of their dreams. I ended up getting almost 70,000 for this freshman year. And get ready for their first year of college with a little peace of mind. I love coming here. For next, I'm Byron Reed. Foundation just got a $75,000 grant from Wells Fargo to keep going. Right now, there are four college and career centers in APS high schools, planning another one for next year.